What's up guys, I'm Boo Carlisle. Welcome back to another episode of Kicking Asphalt. Uh, today's the day, we're going racing again. Uh, it's a little after five o'clock in the morning, so uh, we're gonna get headed out to uh, Lonesome Pine Raceway in Coburn, Virginia. It's about a close to a six hour drive for us, so uh, we're gonna go ahead and hit the road. Get headed off, got everybody here. Mr. Cody, Mr. Miller. A little after 5.15 in the morning. Miller ain't riding on too much sleep. Mm -hmm. Cody bright eyed and bushy tailed. That's me. That's Cody. Got George Strait Station playing all weekend. My wife's gonna hate it. Cody, we ain't gonna burn it down with Alan Jackson. We'll burn it down with George Strait. Get all these big trucks moved and got the trailer out of the way. We'll get everybody lined up. We sure ain't sure if we're gonna spend the night yet or not. We might just try to wing it on back back through the mountains of Tennessee, Virginia. That way we can have a 4th of July. Got everything checked out, parked in the middle of the road. Get on down the road. Made it to the station. Fill this thing up and we'll be headed on to Virginia. Hello, beautiful. What up, Millie? Cody going to get some snack. There Fred over there in his little rental car. Look at Fred, well, hey, let's see what Fred's little rental car. He going to the Ark in Kentucky. Once they leave uh, Virginia, you getting it figured out, Fred? I don't know where the lights is. No, let me out. Trying to figure it out. Hey, we get you a helmet. You run a front wheel drive race tonight. Yep. There's the B double zero super stock. I think we'll call it modified street tonight. Depending on what track we go to, it's, a, it's something different every week. So many rule changes. Thank you, Lord, for another day and a blessed trip. Fred, how come it's so easy to get up at dang three o'clock to go racing, but can't get up five o'clock to go to work? Or don't want to? Yeah, I know. <laughs> Man, I can't tell y'all how excited I am to be able to do this. I've always wanted to do this since I was a kid. You know, travel with a truck full of buddies and uh, go to a race real, real far away in the mountains. So here we go, y'all hold on. Back on 85, headed that way. We're gonna get to see a beautiful sunrise here shortly. Got on up the road a little bit. Man, that sunrise is showing off this morning. We roll into the mountain. My old crew member done passed out on me. Ain't too far out of Asheville, North Carolina now. Entering the great state of North Carolina. Starting to climb these mountains and these hills now. Pretty good time so far. We pulled off a little outside of Asheville, stopped and get us some gas. All we'd find was an Ingalls parking lot or an Ingalls grocery store to pull into. Man, it's got a little crisp air up here though. It's about 10 degrees cooler than what we left. For those keeping track, we $108 into this trip so far in gas to get to the Lonesome Pine Raceway. Can't find a store to go to. We'll go to the Ingle. Them good looking shirts. Y'all look down in the description below to get you, get you one of our 2021 racing shirts. Quick stop for gas, snacks, and a bathroom. Then we're headed back on to Virginia. Silence. Just entered the great state of Tennessee. Dang, Cody won that one. <laughs> Here we go, six percent. So we ain't too far at all now from the racing facility. 
we made it to the entrance road. Real excited to see the racetrack. We'll get on down the entrance road and find the, the facility. The curviest entrance road to a racetrack I've ever been on. Man, it feels so good. 70 degrees is the high today. There it is, fellas. Live and in person, Lonesome Pine Raceway. Cross the railroad track to get in here. That's a first for me anyway. Made it to Lonesome Pine Raceway, Coburn, Virginia. Got the sleeping boys over here. Hey, up, uh, ready to go. Excited to go, already making new friends. Signed in, get us some pit pass. Good looking shirt. What y'all think? Long ride, short ride? Not too bad. Wasn't as bad as you thought. Fred, what'd you think about the ride? Drive's alright. You drive the whole way? No, I didn't. Well, you know you she gotta drove, go back at some point when you leave Kentucky. She drove uh, the Bengals. Sign up, get your wristbands. We'll have somebody else ride it. <laughs> <laughs> Can I just put an X? Yeah, yeah, you don't know how to ride, do you? No. I just figure it out. I just draw a little smiley face, Donald up, Mickey Mouse. Right, boys, let's go check out this Lonesome Pine Raceway. Monte Carlo. Feel good day, don't it, Fred? Yeah. 70 degrees the high today. Be low in the 50s tonight for July 4. Pretty crazy. That's fine. Your See how they got it here. From what we was told, you had to have a uh, enclosed trailer to park on the inside. You got an open trailer. You got to park on the outside. So uh, we'll try to go get this figured out and get unloaded. So open trailer, you got to uh, two spares. Yeah, you unload your car, then you take your trailer outside. You can bring your pickup truck back in. But if you got an enclosed trailer, you can stay in here. That's a first for us, but you know rules is rules. Go ahead and get unloaded and oblige. Getting all our tools out that we think we're gonna need. Man said he he don't know why you got to park in, or uh, open trailers outside, but uh, he said he just follows what he's done. That's a curveball throw for us, but we'll make the best of it. You gonna hit somebody free? Supposed to do with no air. We can't have our air. How you gonna make it work, Fred? You gonna blow it? Hope for the trailer back down so we can take it outside you gonna ride in the back you ready to go yeah i'm gonna tell you get off right don't fall off hold on parked right outside the pit got to drop the trailer huh that cracker barrel. Right, Tell nobody don't steal it. Drive, James. Yep. Drive, James. Like I'm a chauffeur.
Still ain't got a tire carrier yet. So the old left hand is what it's gonna be. Ready to go get some tires, brother? There's the Lawson Pine Raceway front stretch. Got some good banking in the corners. I'd never seen this place till just now. Off to see the wizard, the wonderful tire wizard of Virginia. Over oh, here in line to get tires now. $100 for five tires. Oh, safety truck look like it doesn't seem some better days than got popped in the left front. Made the Lonesome Pine Raceway. We're uh, in line to get tires now. Looks like there's gonna be a little bit of a wait on that, but uh, we're just glad to be here. Uh, practice starts in an hour, so hopefully we got enough time. Y'all hold on. Still waiting in line. Practice starts 10 minutes. Looks like we might miss first practice. Well, after waiting about 45 minutes, finally our turn. Gonna miss first practice. Maybe we just watch though. Probably be best to see what the, what the line is around this thing. They barcoding our tires, so we should be getting mounted up soon. A little aggravated right now. Going out first practice, and I still ain't got tires. An hour and a half we've been waiting in line to get some tires. I got a smile through the, the rain on a sunny day. We ain't gonna get to practice first time, never seen the place. So uh, we'll get one practice and qualify. I heard this place is real bumpy, so I come over here to turn one and two and check out where the line's at. I might be thinking, uh, boo, you're a little uh, outclassed, ain't you? Yeah, just a little bit. But uh, we racers, we ain't excuse makers. Beautiful weather today. We wanted to come race. Been good family time together, and that's exactly what we're going to do. Well, if we can get some tires anyway. Head back over here, tire impound, see what's going on. Maybe they got them mounted up. Well, it looks like they've started at least. That's a big plus. See if we can get some air in these things. I don't know what the fuck they're doing. two new wheels i'm very honorable don't be in no rush we'll uh they'll give us practice after everybody else gets done practicing always something but it's fun went to crank it up and the gas pedal stuck fred on the 
fixing that problem now. Get some real onion rings. And Miller some cheese fries and some cheese burgers and some cheese dogs. Thank you so much to all of you for being out here with us. We'll be the same without you. Got fireworks coming up after. Well, it's a fun track, no doubt about it. Uh, we ain't got enough gear, but uh, I think we'll be all right. We're here to have fun, have a good time, and. Uh, we just got one objective, finish the race. So that's what we're hoping to do. But uh, we'll make some adjustments the best we can from what the little five laps I got. But uh, we'll get ready for qualifying. Just get out there and run your own race. Have a good time. <laughs> Rock-a-bye, baby, on the treetops, when the wind blows. No, stay sweet. Better mess around making new friends. I don't mess around misqualifying. Got to hurry up and get back over here. Y'all hold on. We're going to see if we can lay a lap down to be somewhat close. Hey, we're going to go get that other tube. Oh, yeah, he's still thirsty. Well, I wouldn't buy him. Let's walk over here and look at the track, see what this bump's all about. I don't know if the video will do the banking justice. I think it's 20 degrees is what the, the gentleman said earlier. So the outside line is the preferred groove here. It's a little bumpy. Yeah, that's a lot of bumpy. Get you a quick look at the B double zero, the live oak plantation, race 22, Troy's muffler Camaro, or the m and used cars on the back. Be racing tonight, Lonesome Pine Raceway, Coburn, Virginia. 25 laps, $350 to win. Go ahead, get this thing sealed off, qualifying. Racer 
ready to head out and qualify. Lay down, we get three laps, one dead lap, and then two time laps. Pine Raceway. Pro back to the old days. Kids riding in race cars. Pretty cool deal. Yeah. Okay, pull down here in turn one and pick the kids up, drop them off at the flag stand. A good way to make new fans. Cards are impounded. I'm sitting up there in the front. We're the first to go out to qualify. Can't go touch them. Set tire pressure and that's it. They getting ready to start a opening ceremony, and we'll get going. What's up with the hurry up and wait, Fred? Hurry up and wait. That's get all we do. Hurry up and wait. Hurry up and wait. Hurry up and wait. Get our practice. Get qualifying. Hurry up and wait. Come over here and check out what they got going on. Give it a shot, Fred. Yeah, no. At all? You? A weight distribution <laughs> just too much. Ready, time to go feature racing. Go get suited up. Got one four cylinder race, and then it'll be our turn to go. Starting fifth, 25 laps, $350 a win. That's us up front. Hopefully, we make our way up there once the green drop. Got Miller on spot and duty tonight. Man gets a little nervous. I get a little nervous. We both get a little nervous. Yeah, part of it. Getting ready to go feature racing. <laughs>
Yeah, I'm trying to make you up. Good run, bro. Man, bro, don't finish the last lap. What are y'all doing? This track gets cold. It starts coming out. Like glass. I can hear you when there's a car around me. When I couldn't hear you, when there wasn't a car around me, I couldn't hear you. I mean, I could hear you clear. Uh, fifth place? What do we get? Fifth, six? Fifth, six? Can't be no more happier with this uh, with this team of mine. But we was on the same straightaway. You know, at first we thought we had brought a knife to a gunfight, but I, I really feel like we held our own tonight. Uh, but, uh, Nothing against saying, oh, well, they got better than us or whatnot. It's in the rules. It's no problem. We knew what we were stepping into when we came to Virginia. Just proud we finished on the lead lap. Had a great time today. We'll get loaded up watch the fireworks. Get everything loaded up in the back of the truck so we can uh, go get our trailer. Crazy stuff, but uh, I'm sure they got a reason. I don't know what it is, but uh, I'm sure they got a reason. Everybody's been real nice to us here, so that's what we got to do. That's what we're going to do. As far as the wheel deal goes, I wanted to address that on here because I'm sure, you know, you'll see it, obviously. But uh, the guy came to us, the promoter of the track, he came to us and he said uh, he's going to buy us two brand new wheels. I gave him the part number, the arrow for the arrow wheels. So, uh, he's gonna buy it. But he's going to make it right that uh, a very up, upstanding deal, 100%. He uh, apologized four times, so I don't want no, to make it sound like it was another bad or whatnot. Things happen. So, that's very nice of him. I wish I could remember his name, but uh, he's going to make it right. Uh -huh. July 4th, 65 degrees, Fred. July 4th, day's 30. Yeah, but still July 4th weekend. <laughs> yeah. And it's what? 65 degrees? Yeah. Sixty-four degrees. I need my long john. Long john on July 4th weekend? Yep. Big white, little white. Get them loaded back up, head back towards Georgia, see if we can make the trip tonight. We sang a lot of Alan Jackson and Conway Twitty, see if we're gonna give it a shot. We bought the pizza that was left in the concession stand. Long ride home, we gotta have pizza. We wheeled and dealed some of my car selling buddies be proud. Just got big white out of here. Come out here and get the trailer craziness but you gotta do what you gotta do get everything put back in the trailer so we can take the trailer back in the racetrack and get the race car so we can leave virginia and head back to georgia firework show start we loading the trailer in 65 degrees feel like new year's eve more than it does fourth of july Got the trailer hooked up. They cut the lights out on us. Watch a little firework in action. My front wheel drive guys try to drive in the dark. <laughs> Just watch your head. Tied the slip knot in there. We loaded up. Fred's light done fell off. It's about 11:30. We're getting ready to leave Lonesome Pine Raceway after the fireworks show. For the ones of you wondering, we will. We plan on being at Hickory Motor Speedway next Saturday. So uh, we got a different carburetor that we want to try. We're gonna try to go to Anderson midweek to have their uh, testing tune and uh, make sure everything's good there. Like I said again, Saturday, July 10th. Plan on being at a Hickory Motor Speedway. Well, that's gonna wrap up our day at the Lonesome Pine Raceway. 
It's a little after 11.30. We're going to try to make the drive back to Georgia. So it's got us getting home around 5.15, 5.30 in the morning. So, whew, going to be a lot of singing going on. But y'all uh, like, comment, and subscribe. And uh, we'll catch y'all next time.